Students and faculty, thank you for coming. The time has come for a long-awaited miracle. This young lady will transform right before your very eyes. Watch as she goes from ordinary student to extraordinary genius. Now, prepare to bear witness! Here we go. Wisdom of the universe. This girl longs to be elite and to be successful. I ask of you now, grant her wish! Huh? No, Haley. I'll go. Natsumi, don't do it! I know that life can be really hard. It seems impossible sometimes, but if you overcome those struggles on your own, it makes fulfilling your dreams even better. Don't interfere. <laughs> hey, listen! Who are you to preach about elitism? Seems to me you're the one with a lot to learn. What kind of genius doesn't even know the difference between right and wrong? Aligning yourself with losers doesn't make you elite. The path you're on now is totally pathetic. <laughs> Do you even know what a true elite is? Somebody who lives their life for others and not just for themselves. All this time you've only been focusing on your exams and your nearsighted goals. You've completely lost sight of what's really important. Believe in yourself, have a will of your own. Set your sights high and work for those goals. This academy means the world to me. I love it. All those hours studying together, putting on sports day and our culture festivals. Remember all the things that made you want to come here in the first place. Think back and remember. <sighs> You're right, Haley. I realize now what a school should convey to its students. The value of working hard and blazing your own trail. The strength to tell right from wrong. A sense of responsibility. Not just to yourself, but to all of society. A heart full of desire that yearns to be challenged. And finally, pride in yourself and belief in your school. I will dedicate my life to that, as an educator and mentor to the students of this academy. The Galactic Federation has waited a long time for this moment. The only reason we are here is thanks to the strength and integrity of Team Future, who has managed to form a spiritual magnetic field that has allowed us in at last. <sighs> <sighs>
I want you to know, our Federation has been watching over Earth longer than you can imagine. <gasps> and I must tell you, we feel the moment is long overdue for Earth to learn the truth of the universe, which encompasses the spiritual universe. That means you must open up your minds and usher in a new era of unity between science and spirituality. To you, Team Future, your whole class, and the rest of Nazca Academy, we would like to make a pact with you, starting from this very place, so that the Earth can enter into a new era. <laughs> calling animals you you're all a bunch of followers hello kids mr. Marui no he must be a reptilian huh that's true thanks for the introduction huh I wonder who could have dropped this little thing it's the moon rock not Sumi. it was him all along he's the reptilian who infiltrated the Academy I knew something was going on that night I saw you alone in the woods. All I did was teach you a little lesson about doubting your friends. That's all. <laughs> That's why you tried to split us up. <laughs> so we wouldn't be able to let the Galactic Federation in. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. We know all about you and your agents in the American, Chinese, and Russian militaries, and we're going to stop you. Natsumi! Hey! The reptilians in America are no friends of mine! We are enemies! But we are smarter, more powerful, and much stronger than they can ever hope to be! Competing for ultimate control! Natsumi! What about the Galactic Treaty? The governments of Earth are requesting contact with the Reptilians for keeping their presence in the military secret. Because no rules have been violated, the Federation is unable to intervene. Then I will win and the Earth will be mine. That day will be here soon, but even more than that, what I crave. Proof of my power! Admit to my dominance and bow to me as your supreme master! Why can't you understand me? I am number one in the entire universe! Are we beginning to understand each other? You're a complete idiot. Wait. I think I understand. Hmm? Hmm. Nope, never mind. The Galactic Federation are a bunch of sniveling wimps. You pathetic bunch of insects! It's time for you to be gone once and for all! The Galactic Federation serves the gods. If you aim to please the gods, then you should fight and win! The true way to show the gods honor is to fight with victory! Such as I do! The gods seek only happiness of the mind and spirit. What do you plan to do after taking over the Academy? <sighs> I couldn't care less. It's just a simple decoy. My plan is to gather the Galactic Federation and the Guardians of the Earth and finish them all off. That's my goal. <sighs> you children couldn't begin to outsmart me. Guardians of the Earth? That is an impossible feat. And now, victory will be mine. <laughs> Signal has reached out to Dahar! Dahar? 
Anyone who dares to get in my way will be sent to the Dark Side universe! What is he saying? Dahar is the messenger of the Dark Side universe. He is the servant of the evil god. The servant of the evil god? What's the Dark Side universe? <laughs> What's happening now? Dark energy was sent out from the evil god, and it will suck everything around it into the dark side universe. <laughs> I have allied with the Chinese military. The ones in my way are you, the wretched guardian gods of planet Earth, and the Galactic Federation. Sounds impossible, but I'll use Dahar's power to eliminate both of them once and for all. We'll seize power in Asia, and then our final plan, bringing down those horrid American reptilians, the bane of my existence. Then we'll be the winners! Don't you know you do not use the evil god? The truth is that the evil god of the universe is using you. I really don't care, as long as I win. How foolish. Get out of me! If we don't stop this energy, the whole Earth will sink into the Dark Side universe. No, not the whole Earth. Ha 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 